Hello Zebraherd, welcome back to Mario & Luigi Bowser's Inside Story. Today, we are making our way through Bowser's Waterworks. Of course, he's drinking a bunch of water, so we're swimming around here, having a good time, and hopefully everything will turn out okay. We got another one of these globe and things. All globe and all the time. Oh, pipish things on soft floor, how I long to slide the analog stick down upon you, for then I would pass through. Try, see, be globin'. Okay, so I'll try that now, I suppose. We'll see what ends up happening. Nothing. Uh. Oh, we can go down this orange one. Where does it lead? Down here. All right, what do we get? Oh, hey, so I guess we need to, it was, what was it? Oh, was I supposed to pay attention? Um, I guess so, Mario, Luigi, Mario, Luigi, Mario. Okay, Mario, Luigi, Mario, Luigi, and finally, Mario. I got it, oh, look at that! Uh, pump works attack pieces. You got attack piece number one. Nine left to find. That is very good to know that there's some attack pieces to look for. So we'll be doing exactly just that, looking for them. Hope everything will turn out okay. Okay, now that we've done that one, let's try to go down the pink one. So neither the green or the pink ones work so far. Okay, good to know. No, wait, all globing all the time. I know, I know. Uh, let's try to get up this way. And it looks like that's a bit over, uh, about it over here. Oh, look, it's a giant blooper. Can I fight you? I can! How does battling in the water work? Guess we're about to find out. Oh, hey, look at these little guys, too. So, this seems actually it could be a bit difficult. Let me go ahead and focus on the Goombules first. I don't know if there's anyone to attack in the water, so we might already be, like, unable to get an advantage, which is a bit scary. Okay, let's see if we can't do this. Whoa, whoa! <laughs> Wasn't expecting that. Thought he was gonna swim around. The giant blooper is funny. I love him. Um, what is his name? Bubble Blooper. I just love all the remixes on all the enemies. So battling seems to be the same underwater except for the fact that we can't get like early attacks in before the battle starts. Let's go ahead and just jump on this dude and see how much damage we can do. Boom and boom. Got that, excellent. So is he gonna go for us? Oh, that missed. Oh, so he bounces once. Okay, so he has sort of a myriad of attacks we'll have to be worried about. Oh, that missed? Okay, so we can't hit him with a hammer. Gotta keep that in mind. So Mario keeps getting healed by his new overalls that we got him at the end of the last episode, so that's pretty good to keep in mind. Got a total of six damage there. And boom, just barely let go at the right time, and that was enough to take him out, so that was pretty good. All right, good job, you guys. 16 experience for each of them, a little bit closer to a level up, but not quite there. Okay, so, whoa, there's another one down this way. First off, we got Star Candy, which I don't even know what that is, but let's take on this dude. Wait, did that hurt Luigi? I have no clue. Did it? No, that that helped. It seemed like Luigi held his foot as if that hurt. So I guess you can go over top of them. Weird. Okay, there's six more damage. And he's gonna bounce, and then we boom. Got him good there. So, so far he hasn't been able to land any damage. Let's keep it that way by boop and bop. And that's enough to take him down. He honestly doesn't have as much health as I expected. Maybe because I've been used to fighting with Bowser who can do over 60 damage per attack now. He is insane. That was a lot of fun with that boss fight last episode and learning the wind move. Like there was a lot of cool stuff going on last episode. Definitely check it out. Okay, so there was a pipe over this way that maybe we could go down. Still no, so that only one of those pipes worked. But hey, there's stuff over this way. Another piece perhaps. It looks like it on the, on the menu here. So try this out. What do we get? Uh, we got pump works, attack pieces, you got piece number two. Piece left to find are eight. Okay, so eight more pieces left to, whoa. Can we get this guy without him? No, that busted our feet, didn't it? See, like, how am I supposed to attack him without that happening? I don't know. I mean, maybe I can use my hammer underwater. Poor Mario. Okay, so I'll have to deal with these guys. It's a lot of enemies, but definitely worth doing, so I wanna go for it. Ooh, because I wanna do as many battles as possible. I want my characters to be nice and powerful. At least for now, until I get bored of battling. Whoa, I, I'm not used to that one. <laughs> okay, Luigi, go ahead and use your hammer on this dude. And boom. That's at least enough to take them down in one hit, which is always good. Is there, like, they're, they're like spike blobs or something. So that's good. Maybe I'll focus on the big dude, because I know if we knock that guy away with our hammer later, that will be enough to take him out. Just like when he attacks us, so we just have to worry about it then. Okay, he's gonna bounce. Yeah, perfect. And will you attack? Not quite yet. I can't jump on him, he'll dodge it. So this should be enough to take care of the uh, bubble blooper. 
And it actually isn't, he's a toughie. Boom, that's enough to take you out though, so that's all I'm really worried about there. Okay, Mario, do you get to attack? Indeed you do. Got it, and got it. And there he goes, he's down, we we'll get another item for that one. Is it another star candy? It's a one-up mushroom. Pretty good. Okay, so lots of experience there. Mario gets a level up, he's level four. I'm tempted to up his power a bit more. Cause I just feel like we need a strong hitter between Mario and Luigi, and I think that's gonna be Mario. So, got another plus four. We've been on a roll with that recently. Get it, on a roll, because it, it rolls through the numbers. <laughs> okay, <laughs> keep going. Um, What else is going on around here? So like maybe, I mean, yeah, I can actually just use my hammer in here, so. Okay, so I should be good. If we actually get Bowser to stop drinking water, we can get through this. So let's actually switch back to Bowser and make him stop, maybe? That seemed to work. I don't know why the screen's so much darker now. That was odd. Um, Still can't get up here, though. Oh. Weird. That didn't quite help yet. Um, Bowser, okay, start drinking the water again, if you don't mind. There he goes, perfect. Yep, everything's gonna change. We can speed this up a little bit, that's good. So yeah, I don't know how to get up there for right now, still. I need to find, oh. Is there a pipe over here that I missed? Well, there is, but I can't quite get into it. Huh. I don't know if I should try these pipes again. It is where there's like, oh, try the pipes. And all but one of them didn't work. Yeah, this definitely isn't working. I don't know if I should try these with the water being down. It might be a good idea. I mean, what about, the, the other room was sort of a dead end. Yeah, it was definitely a dead end, so it isn't really worth doing too much more there. And I can't go down this way because of the water thing as well. So I might just have to experiment a little bit with the water being down. Maybe there are pipes I can do or move or whatever. Okay, go ahead and move Bowser. Ready for this? Come on, Bowser, buddy. Yep, I know about that. Just speeding everything up a little bit would be helpful. Hold on, no, we're not Bowser. Move back to Mario and Luigi. I mean, maybe going up on the other side would do something, the other side of the statue? I doubt it. Yeah, this is still stuck how it is. Weird. Nothing seems different. Okay, then. What's going on here? Oh, I see, I didn't realize that this was its own thing. Okay, I didn't see that for some reason. I'm such a dingus, it's my fault. I got it now. Okay, so moving over here, I can hit this with a hammer. That's gonna hurt Bowser for one reason or another, right? Get rid of the blue things, that's good. So we're gonna move out of here, switch over to Bowser, walk him over to the right, and speed all this up. Perfect. Yep, 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 water goes up. I'm glad you can speed up little animations like that. Isn't that cool? So now we just gotta swim over, and we could go to the right, or we can switch back to Bowser again and make him move off of it. Just like that. Back to the, the bros. Oh no, I messed up my jump. Oh no, I messed up my jump, really? <laughs> oh, that's silly. Come on, you could have made that jump a little bit smaller. Ay ay ay. come on, back up. And then Mario and Luigi get up here. It's a little tedious, gotta be honest. I mean, I, I know if I was better at puzzle solving, it wouldn't have been that big of a problem. Got it, so what does this do for me? That is gonna remove that thing on the pipe, which is good. So I don't know what I'm gonna do with that thing to the left anyways. I mean, I'm sure there's stuff to check out, so maybe we should check it out, oh boy. Okay, I think that we're good for making Bowser drink a, a lot more water for a while, so get back to that. He's gonna do it, and we can start swimming around again. So let's try going to the right. It should just transfer us down here. Where? I don't know if there's anything too crazy going on. I just wanted to check it out. Oh, there's some question blocks. That's all I really need. Syrup jars times two. Uh, buttons are not working anymore. That was weird. Um, really, what's happening? I just, okay, I guess I can't get too far away from each other. And we got parry glasses. What are those? Are those, is that an accessory? Gear, um, you know, like, parry glasses. The wear will automatically guard against enemy attacks. I don't know if that's actually worth it. Uh, because I'd rather attack back. 
It doesn't mean automatically guarded doesn't automatically attack back. Like, that could be good. That's what it means, I'm not sure. So yeah, it looks like we got some stuff over here. Got some coins we can earn up real fast. And then there are some enemies that we should just be able to land right on top of. We got it. Okay, so is it just uh, Goombules? Not quite. That did not hurt him though, look at that. Got rid of all of them, we got a mushroom, a syrup jar, and a syrup jar. That was beautiful. Maybe even enough for a level up for Luigi? You bet it is. So is that level four or level five for Luigi? It's level four, he's really behind, poor guy. Okay, so with all those bonus stats, what do we wanna get more of? Um, Okay, his BP is up, so we should be able to move forward. What's going on now? Uh, we can go ahead and bump this stuff a little bit. We got a couple more coins in it. And this one as well, we got a one-up mushroom. Okay, we're getting some good stuff. I like it. So we're just basically gonna loop around, I suppose, until we um, get back around and we can use that one pipe in that other room. Seems perfect to me. Glad we could get a lot of goodies along the way. I didn't wanna talk to you, I'm sorry. I've heard all about it already. So let me just get Luigi swimming. There we go, good job, Luigi. Okay, so Bowser's still drinking a bunch of water over there. Hope he's thirsty. I mean, even too much water can be bad for you. You gotta be careful. Everything in moderation. So what's going down this way? Uh, we got like DNA strands, weird. Okay, Globin. All things lead to Globin. Oh, precious DNA-ish door I see. Even doors have hearts. Yours cries for what goes bzzzt. Find it, find the electric bzzzt. Reunite it with this lonely door. Oh, I must cry out Globin, the Globin of it all. Hmm, odd. So there's some DNA that I guess needs like an electric shock. Let's go ahead and save real fast and then maybe we can figure it out. Maybe our new attack is like electrical. Uh, so let's go ahead and save because we got both Mario and Luigi some level ups since then. Oh, I, I don't know why I thought Mario was level four. Bowser drank water and it filled his belly, searched the pump works inside Bowser. That's what we're doing, so let's continue. Okie doke, so let's keep moving to the right. And we definitely have two more thingamajigs up this way. Got that one right there. A lot of these are just chilling out. So that's piece number three, piece number four, and then up on the top right, I see piece number five. So that'll be good. Whoa, okay, we got this guy. Get up here, watch it buddy, boing. I wonder if I could land on them both at once, Mario and Luigi, how that would do. But I'm sure Mario would be better than Luigi because he does have more power, but that's still four damage each, which is always good. So it looks like both Mario and Luigi have their own guy to deal with. Boom, and boom, that's 10 damage, that dude is down. And will Luigi be able to attack before him? You bet, which is always good to see. Got it, got it. Not enough to take him down, unfortunately, but we'll be ready for him. Ah, oh, I'm still kind of trying to get used to the timing of that one. It's real fast. Okay, Mario, just jump on him. Should be good, just with that. 10 more damage, excellent stuff. Get a couple more coins. Okay, so 20 more experience for the both of them. So Luigi's actually not that far behind when it comes to experience. Not as much as I thought there. Okay, let's keep swimming up. What other enemies might we have to deal with? Are you an enemy? Oh, you seem to be. Um. Oh, did that work? I think it worked. What in the world is this thing? Looks odd. I don't think I've ever seen this in a Mario game before. <laughs> nice damage there though, that was beautiful. Whoa, you didn't like it very much. We got the syrup jar. What is this dude? I'm gonna go ahead and hit him with a hammer. He is the protobatter. Okay. That did good, that was 11 damage, but he just grew bigger. I don't like the sound of that. I don't know if I should jump on him with that bat. I think it'd be bad. Boom, got rid of him before he could attack, which is good and bad. I need to learn those attacks eventually, I'm sure. But 25 experience is pretty good for the bros, so I will gladly take it. Okay, so with that done, Let's keep moving over, actually, let's move up so we can get this thing, this attack real fast. Actually, yeah, I do see that there's sort of more than one way to move to the right. There's like an upper path and a lower path. I'm gonna try the upper path first. Boom, land on him, just like we did with the other one. And let's see what happens. Okay, two of these guys. Luigi can handle them, no problem. And so should we. Ready, boom, and boom, 10 damage to you. And then Luigi, can you handle this? I sure hope so. Whoop. It's not quite enough to take him out, unfortunately. But maybe this will be. Ah, that was too soon that time. Jeez. At this rate, it seems like, I guess Luigi has more health than Mario. Weird, was not expecting that. Okay, so we got a total of 10 HP there. And we're good. Okay, so with that done, what else do we got going on? 
Um, let's see, yeah, both swim up at once and see what's going on over here. First off, another enemy. This time, I think Mario landed on him, hard to tell. We're about to find out. No, it was Luigi, if you say so. I don't know. Okay, so yeah, just get back to jumping. Nice, got it. It would be good if Luigi could get like a lucky critical or something, but it doesn't seem to be happening. I don't know if his hammer strike would be any more than eight damage, but I doubt it. Come on, I'm getting it this time. Yeah, we got it, so no damage taken whatsoever this round. That is beautiful to see. We get a mushroom for it, which is always good. Another 20 experience, so those guys are 10 experience each. Which isn't too bad for how easy they are to take out. So there's a little question block with some coins, but I can't quite fit in there, so. I guess that's all we can do in this area, that's fine. Let me swim back down this way. And head over this way. Only way we can really go for now. No more pieces here to the attack. Don't know what this is about. Maybe another electrical thing. We can figure out our electric moves. Might be a good bet. Hmm. So what is going on here? Both of those led to the same exit, which is a little bit odd. What is this thing? Oh, I don't know, that's creepy. What is that doing in Bowser's body? I don't like it one bit. We hit the pink exclamation mark and that sent away the little thingamajigs. Okay, <laughs> that's a bit odd. We get another piece of something. Uh, pump work attack pieces, you got piece number six, so four more left to find. I'm gonna try to get Mario to land right on top of you. Let's see if this is, does any extra damage, it should. So instead of four, it should do five. Yep. That might be all we need to uh, take them out in the first turn. We're about to find out. Boom, and boom, definitely will take you out in the first turn, because the four damage usually does too. So for Luigi, got it, and got it, and it indeed is enough. So it was really just a difference of one HP that we're having a hard time with there. Okay, a little bit more experience. We're inching towards the level five for both Mario and Luigi, which is always good to see. Okay, so now that we've done that, I'm just gonna keep traveling on the upper path here. Can we land on you? Was that a good idea, bad idea, I don't really know. Can we land on him, or does that just hurt? And I guess it would actually, no, that was good. Ooh, he's not happy about it though. So let me go ahead and get rid of his friends first. Good stuff, 12 damage, that is massive. That actually is more than jumping. What about for Luigi? I mean, I'm sure it depends on defense and stuff too. Boom, nine damage, that is better than jumping as well. Whoa, whoa, that's weird, that's weird. It bounces a little bit, gotcha. So let's try the hammer again on this dude. And boom, did 11 damage, plus one BP for it as well. And you know what, since it's just one enemy, we might as well give it a try and see how things go. We'll use the shell attack that I'm never ever good with. See if we can't do anything good with it. No, we can't. <sighs> Eight damage, it's not really that much. Boom. Okay, we, we smacked it away that time, so it didn't do any damage to him, but at least it got away, away from us. Wind it up, and boom! Got rid of him, very good. So that is a syrup jar waiting for us, and probably a good chunk of experience at 25, not too bad. Uh, we'll take it, and we'll keep moving forward. So what else is going on around here? We got a question block up this way, which had two mushrooms, and then I gotta be diligent when checking down here. Wanna make sure we didn't miss any battles, which we did. So land on his head. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. Good luck, Mario and Luigi. Land on him. Boom! Six damage. So that gets rid of his little friends, which is perfect. He's gonna get mad. And normally we do 11 damage when doing the hammer. So what do we do here? We do 10. So the hammer is better for now. Okay, Luigi, go ahead and use the hammer then. If we time it correctly, that is. Eight damage. So that's about equal to what we normally do. Got it, okay. So I'm getting a little bit more used to that guy's attacks. So we did 10 damage before, we do 11 damage here, so yeah, that's about right. Okay, got him down, and that should be another 25 experience, which means maybe a level up, yep, for Mario. Very, very good. He's still in mushroom rank, but he's in level five now. I'm tempted to up his power again. I mean, he has really high defense. Yeah, honestly, just has all around really good stats. But I think his, no, I, I should've. Maybe wait a little bit longer there. We got plus two though, that's always good. Well, let's keep going. What do we got going on this way? Anything of interest, not looking like it. So I think we're good to move out of this room and into the next one. 
I do see already there's a little piece, a little puzzle piece for this next room, it seems. Indeed there is. Get a question block that has two more syrup jars. This weird creepy dude up here again, which I can't do anything about. And what about the Globin? The hungry soul needs Globin. The hungry chombone needs more. And so out it leaps upon that which it craves. Oh, wildly ravenous chombone. How can Goblin coax you out by pushing that which floats? Oh, okay, hold on, hold on. Um. Nope, okay, I can't go up there. Trying to go around it, but we can't have Mario and Luigi go too far from each other, it gets a little awkward. Boom, smack this thing, and that should give us a thing. Okay, so can I just go down the pipe now? No. I can't really touch it. Weird. So I'm guessing we're supposed to bring it over there, but can I push it? Yes, I can. Very, very odd. <laughs> well, you're gonna eat that up. And what do we get for it? Oh, I don't think he liked that very much. Ooh, he is out of here. That must not feel good. And there's another one. <laughs> okay, I, mean, I think we're fine with what we got there. What's going on down this way? It looked like there were a couple of enemies like you! Get out of here! I don't know if these guys are supposed to sort of look like shy guys, because they sort of look like shy guys to me. They have that look to them. Anyways, we got rid of the two enemies right away. This should be the level up for Luigi, which will be really exciting. And we're gonna go ahead and hit him with the hammer. Ooh, charge it up. And let it rip. Boom. Very nice. Okay, oh, he's dizzy. Oh, that's very nice for us as well. Ooh. Boom, eight damage, and he's down for the count. Oh, he gave us one coin? Oh, no, no, dude. Okay, level up for Luigi. Very, very good. Level five. Okay, so let's find out what we wanna do here. I feel like it might be worth it to up his power just a little bit. I'm obsessed with power. Like, maybe defense would be better. He has a lot of HP. Hmm, lots of options. I feel like since he does get attacked quite often, we got the plus four there. Since we, he does get attacked quite often because he does have the lower speed, I think we should just play into his uh, strengths here and just up his defense even farther. Um, nothing more to the left, but there is the big blooper. Boom. Let's see how things happen here. Hopefully, wow. So far, so good. Seven damage to both of them is really nice. Go ahead and hammer. Ooh. Oh, I forgot. <laughs> Dang it. I'm silly. Sorry. Okay, well, could have done a little bit better timing there. Got him, that was good, that was good. So, Mario, go ahead and jump on him, don't use the hammer. And there we go, they're gone. So there's an easy 20 experience for everybody, not too big of a deal. Doesn't really even level low or higher the, the meter too much anymore, the flagpole. Which is such a cool idea for a little meter. There we go, we got it. Oh wait, not quite. So it was Luigi Mario, Luigi Mario, just back and forth. So Luigi, no, wait, there we go. Mario, Luigi, Mario, Luigi. And there we go, there's a piece. Number seven, we'll have to find just three, so hopefully we find some more of those over this way. Ooh, not quite, but we do see a save block. That's good. Ooh, okay, so we actually need to get Bowser to stop drinking here. All right, Bowser, yep, just let up. You need to stand over there for us. Ooh, what happened? Oh, it's Toadsworth! Hey, buddy! You're trapped in there. Masters Mario and Luigi, you're, you're hale and hearty. Yep. After that great lout inhaled me, I awoke a bit uh, uh, ad, adulpated. I walked hither and thither, and now I've become quite stuck. Hey, where's Princess Peach? Isn't she with you? What, the princess? Don't tell me she was inhaled as well. Yes, yeah, Bowser's got everyone. Uh, we're in a real fix. Even Toadsworth doesn't know where the princess is. Horrors, the princess, it rends the heart. All, all alone within, within Bowser's body, on her own, and such filth, or amid such filth. Dear princess! <laughs> Calm down, dude, it's fine. Huh? Oh yeah, right, we need to get Toadsworth out of here. He lost it. Hmm. The shame. The thing is, the barrier looks tough. I doubt even a hammer would dent it. Mario. Oh, what's that? There's one of those blocks around here? Huh? Something's over there? 
Oh, are we using the little squish move again? We use this in the Superstar Saga game. Looks like the gap's too narrow for your body size. You'll never get through. I'm well, trying to bring out an old move from the guidebook, right? What, you have an idea? Uh, I don't know if he seems very up to it. <laughs> oh, it looks like they got it. All right, Luigi. Yeah, just like that, but with Mario right next to him. I see, I get it now. If there's something you don't know, just come talk to me. Okay, so what we need to do is, I guess talk to you. First, switch the action icon to your hammer by pressing L or R. Then press B to have Luigi hit Mario, not too hard. Okay, so yeah, what we do is we have Luigi hit Mario just like that, and he becomes a mini Mario, genius! Now that he is squashed, he can fit through just about anywhere. You know, not just anyone would trust his brother enough to do this. And she was added to the guide, so yeah, we can actually get to quite a few, area, a few areas we haven't been to just yet. Okay, so we'll go, let's go ahead and do that. And it's all cleared up. Yay! Huzzah, sweet freedom, Master Mario, Master Luigi, my deepest thanks. I dare say Master Mario and company will now seek the princess, hmm? Marvelous, simply marvelous. The princess must be made safe at all costs. Speaking of which, I should tell you as I made my way here, I spotted a huge flat bug by some sort of door. It was treacherous to be sure. I shudder to think of it, but it would attack the princess. Right now, with that large foul bug in, in the sure hands of Master Mario and Luigi, I shall be off. I believe it would behoove us all if I were to find another toads, to find the other toads and glean what I can. All right, good luck. Help the princess, I count upon you. Gotcha. Okay, so what happens if we hit this then? Uh, Yeah, I guess that undoes this little area. Pretty cool, pretty cool. And there's plenty left to explore now that we got the little miniature version. But for now, I guess we could, actually let me try to save first, and then we'll get Luigi to go through the one thing, then we'll have to definitely get some water in here to hit that one question block. Okay, so for right now, yeah, it seemed like I said the same thing, Bowser drank water and yada, yada, yada. So Mario should just be able to go right through here. If we want Mario to go back to normal size, I'm pretty sure we just need to hit him again, and he should just fine. Oh, look at this, precise jumping, and boom, got it. So that undoes that, and then if we go down here, like I said, uh, switch to jumping, and we get some leisure wear. That might be good. Is that the thing that was worth 100 coins? Maybe, I'll have to equip that later. Uh, so what's for right now? Have that happen. And save again, because, you know, this might be a good idea. Continue. And let's move to the left. All right, don't forget to restore your HP and BP. I would love to. Oh, oh, hey. Oh, oh I hit him there, actually. Weird. <laughs> I didn't, I didn't expect that. So what's going on with these guys? Oh, we got some normal bloopers. They look actually a little weird. They look paper thin. This is Paper Mario all of a sudden. Dried blooper, that's sort of creepy. Poor things. Go ahead and try to jump on him. There we go, we got rid of him. And we're gonna switch over, oh no, not quite switching over to Luigi. Whoa, that is weird, but we did it. I was not expecting that. Okay, finally, not finally, but let's just move on over. I mean, yeah, I guess it is finally. He's the last guy. Bada boom! 10 damage to him right off the bat. He's gonna grow bigger, he ain't so happy about it. Let's see what he does. Got him. Okay, so, go with this, and wind it up, and let it rip! 15 damage there as well, very cool. So there we go, we got 35 experience for both of them, and that's pretty good. So we'll be able to continue forward with that. And there's more enemies for sure, and I'm gonna be taking on as many of them. Oh wait, that's right, I didn't ever got the, the little question block over this way. I mean, I'm sure it's fine to turn on the water now, so if we wanted to, uh, yeah, there's no way I'm reaching that from here. So Bowser, go ahead and help us out here, buddy. Um, I just need to do that, and then speed this all up. And we can get back to swimming. Boom, we get ourselves a nut, which we didn't have any before. They restore 30 HP to both of the bros, so that can be pretty good if in, in a pickle. And anything up here? You bet there is. 10 coins. So that was very good. 
And I'll land on this dude. They're a bit more helpless when they're in the air like that, so that's good. Or when, when we're swimming and they're stuck in the floor or whatever. Boom, got seven damage to each of those guys as well. He already grows a little bit bigger, and I think I wanna get rid of the, uh, the, the bubble bloopers first. Boom, got it, got rid of him. And with Luigi, just wanna do the same thing to the other bubble blooper. There we go, and that gave us something it is, a mushroom. So let's see. Oh, he missed. That's weird. <laughs> We're able to handle it just fine though. So move to the hammer now that we can actually hit this guy with it. We couldn't hit the other guy with it, so. Kaboom. 15 damage with that one, very nice. If Luigi can hit something good as well, that might be enough to finish him off. And boom, it is. We get another present for it. It is syrup probably, yep, syrup jar. 35 experience for that one. So I think it's five or 15 experience for the, the guy with the hammer, and then 10 experience for each uh, bubble blooper. It seems to be what's panning out there. So what do we got over this way? We got ourselves some syrup jars, very good. And then I'm gonna try land on that dude's head. So I can't go under the staircase here just yet, I don't think. I mean, maybe I can from a certain angle, but I gotta double check. So boom, seven damage to easy. Oh, this'll be an easy battle. Easy, easy, just gotta jump on both of them. Got it, and got it. Seven damage for a total of 14. And boop. There it is. Not even a single point of damage available to be taken. We just beat them up before their attack. Very, very good. So with that being said, let's keep moving over this way. Because there's definitely no way down. So I'm just gonna have to come back for that other other thing. I don't know what I'm gonna have to do for that. What's going on over here? Got another one of these creepy dudes. I don't like it. Another one here as well. There's also a pipe to go down and a button to press. So let's first press this button. What happens? Will that just unlock the door? Or maybe it'll give us something through this pipe. Gotcha. So that is over like that. So if I push this to the right, it should go to this guy who will eat down into another little um, action piece. So I could speed this if I wanted to, and I might, just because we've seen it before. Just eat through this thing. I love the little speed up function. That makes things a little bit easier. Okay, hope nobody minds that I use it, especially for something like that. Since we've already seen it, technically. All right, we got it, very cool. Please let the finder too. We're gonna get up this way and try that again. And hopefully this time, um, we can give it to the guy on the left and he can bring us down there, which I don't know what's down there. Might just be some extra goodies, might be something else. Only one way to really find out now, isn't there? Okay, we're gonna eat through all those bones. You'd think that would hurt him, but I guess they were decaying bones. Okay, so floating down this way, perfect. Oh, I see, it's one of these. I just have to say, I've really been enjoying this game. It's been a lot of fun. Just because it's so different in such a fun way. Like, Superstar Saga was great, but obviously it was pretty basic because it was sort of the introduction to the game series, but now things have been a bit more complicated and it's been really, really enjoyable. Um, and just like, you know, we're not even too far into the game. It's like an hour or two. And I'm just having a blast, you know, it's been great. So this is the second to last piece. I know where the other piece is, I just don't know quite how to get to it, but hopefully we can figure that out as we go along. So we got nine pieces in total now. We just need that one. And let me look around, take on whatever enemies I can like this dude, and we'll get to it. A lot of people have been asking if I plan on playing any of the other Mario Luigi games. For right now, we'll have to see what else might get ported to the 3DS. Some people are saying this is the last one that'll get ported. Some people are saying it won't be. So we'll just have to wait and see. And then maybe if none of them end up getting ported to anywhere, we'll just play them on the original hardware. Whatever ends up happening, I'm sure we can figure it out. There we go, 15 damage to you, you're dizzy now too. Don't really know what dizzy means, like does that mean like Pokemon style where they can attack but they might end up hurting themselves? I forgot to press the button, but three damage was enough to take them down, so that is quite lucky. 25 experience for the both of them, that's good. Okay, so we have 400 coins in total, that is an insane amount. So with that done, we could go down this pipe. Over here, there's a button to press. I will press that button. Yeah, that is just gonna give us a little opening back to where we were before. Oh, and another one of these. Ah, we can feed this to the one dude. Okay, I don't know quite what that'll do for us, but we'll figure it out. So get up here. Well, I can't push it anymore that way. So maybe it's not for him, but it's for somebody else. Interesting. Okay. Yeah, keep going this way for now. Cause you can, I guess, push it between floors, which I wasn't expecting. So what do we do now? Was that not right? 
Maybe that wasn't right. I thought that there was a dude over here. I guess it's just that cannon. I feel like there's more I gotta do here, but I gotta get my power up first. So I wanna look through the map. Because I still don't know how to get to this thing. Like maybe there was a way to skirt under it that I just didn't see. But there should be some other places I can explore. Maybe not around here. But definitely over this way. There were a couple of places I could only get when I was miniature. I had thought, but maybe I'm wrong. Yeah, like right over there. Okay, so maybe there is more I can do over that way first. I wanna figure this out. Because I need to go on the left side of this room and just go from there. Where the puzzles get real tricky, aren't they? Okay, so Mario and Luigi get down this way. I don't know if enemies, oh, they do respawn. Let's go ahead and get some extra battles in then. It's always worth doing. So we're just gonna get more and more powerful that way. So, boom, get rid of those guys right off the bat, and then Mario and Luigi can just hit them with their hammers, or hit this guy with his hammer. Or hit this guy with their hammer. That makes sense. I don't know why I can't speak grammatically. Correct, I pressed the button at the wrong time again. He didn't like it. I can't wait to learn more bros moves though. Like, I like the one we have, but I wanna learn more. Okay, so that's gonna bounce, and we're just gonna smack it. Very good. And got it. And that's enough to take him down. Okay, so syrup jar, very good. And 25 more experience. Very good as well. So we'll keep moving forward. I know this guy's probably gonna try to get me. I'm just trying to land on top of him so I can get some good advantages, and indeed I do. Very nice. So with that, what are we gonna get here? Seven damage each, pretty good, pretty good. And we gotta jump on both of these guys, we can't use the hammer. Which is very weird, because you have to use a hammer to defend against them, but you can't use it to attack them. Makes it seem like a little bit misleading. But that's enough to get rid of both of them, which is all we really wanted to see. All right, 20 experience, very close to our next levels, which is why it's worth doing all that kind of stuff. Okay, with that done, we're gonna swim on up this way, where there's another dude. Got him. And I got him with Mario, which is what really matters. Boom, seven damage each again. It's gonna be the same battle as last time. Jump on them. Don't mess it up and we will be good. There's a present, probably a mushroom. Yep, <laughs> pretty good at calling that so far. So there's a decent amount of enemy variety, but of course we're sort of getting used to the enemies in this area. I really do hope though that Mario and Luigi can explore outside of Bowser in the Mushroom Kingdom. Like I think, I think so. I think that might be later down the line, but I do think that'll happen and I think that'll be pretty fun. Okay, so let's go ahead and whoop, get fighter wear. So that was a good bonus to get, but not what I was looking for. Hmm, so I'll keep looking around and we'll see what else we can figure out. Oh, I can just walk right by this. Oh, that's weird. Okay, there we go. We got all 10 pieces. I can't believe I missed that, that's funny. Um, and we got a new bros attack. So what will this one be? Oh, something. What is with all the puzzle pieces on the top? Pump pieces. Okay, then we got fire flower. You can now use fire flower. What's up, wanna watch a demo? Sure, let's figure the fire flower out. To throw lots of fireballs, tap A when Mario's fire is at maximum size, and then B when Luigi Luigi's fire is at maximum size. If they manage to throw lots of fireballs, the bros will be able to finish things off by throwing many giant fireballs together. The more fireballs you throw, the more damage you will deal to the enemy. Keep tapping those buttons. So let's go ahead and practice it and see what ends up happening. So, press A, and then why charge? Uh, oh, okay, I get it. So you just, okay. Interesting. So let's try that again. I sort of get, this one's a lot more simple. So when his is big, and then we gotta sort of like switch over as soon as possible, which has a bit of a pacing to it. There we go. Whoa, 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 there's more, there's more. Okay, so if we do a lot of them, we get a ton. Very cool, okay, that's all I need to see. That one's awesome. I really like that one, a lot more simple. So I think I should be able to do pretty good with that one. Um, back in now, and we will try to Figure out what we gotta do next. I mean, maybe that might not even help us. Wait, I actually, I actually pressed Bowser. Um, that's fine, because I need him to fill up the water anyways. There we go. Um, I'm still, yeah, a little confused. There must be some kind of puzzle here that I'm trying to solve, because I can probably hit this thing and get the thing to come out again. 
But I already fed both of these dudes. So like, what good would that do? I don't know. I don't think it would do very good at all. Because I would like to move that one into here, maybe. I mean, I guess that wouldn't really help too much. Because we'll just spit it out where this thing can already be spat out. The thing is, like, how do I get over to the thing? Like, maybe I have to be fast enough? Like, I don't know if there's something I'm missing or not. Can't go down this pipe. Well, I've already pressed it, so there's no way I can get it over here unless there's something I'm, like, majorly missing, which there has to be. So, let me try to figure that out now. Oh, you know what it is. I just now realize I know what it is. Okay, so what we're gonna do, I think, let's try this out. I need Bowser to stop drinking the water so that stops floating. It'll land in there, yep. Okay, so where is that gonna be launched to? Um, I'm not sure. Luigi, where are you? You're down there. Uh, ooh, now, yeah, okay, I get it. Now we can do that. Mario can do this. And that'll probably launch that thing, right? You bet. Where's it gonna go? Who knows? <laughs> we'll find out in a moment. For now, though, let me go ahead and get whatever this is. Oh, some coins, very good. And got him. Okay, so we're probably gonna have to have Bowser. We'll have to wait for now to find out. Okay, yeah, let's have Bowser restore water in here. Because I don't know exactly what's going on, and it'll be easier to explore once we do that. That was a bit complicated, but we figured it out. Let's go ahead and get Mario to normal size, just in case. Don't know what happens if you go into a battle when he's tiny Mario. So now all we have to do is get over here, push it to the left, and it should just go right into his mouth. And that'd be perfect. We're gonna speed this one up as well, just because we can get the idea. <laughs> all right. Got it. So with that done, let's go down there and figure this out. I think we'll be good. Yeah, it's like this giant electrical thing, which if we touch it, whoa. You got the Stingler! Use it somewhere around here. I will. Indeed I will, indeed. What, I don't know. Anyways, yeah, well, all we gotta do, I think, is bring it back to the door. So that's exactly what we'll get done now. And hopefully everything will turn out okay. Because we've definitely thoroughly explored everything around here, so unless we just want to get some extra battles done for fun to get some extra experience, I think we're good to move on. So, you know, we might take out anything like in our way, but beyond that, I'm a little sick of seeing, you know, bubble bloopers and the other guys. Okay, oh, nah, I'm gonna keep going, like I said. Let's see what's going on with this door, because we should be good with it now. Might be good to save as well. And saving. And nothing too crazy should be going on. But we can mess with this door now. Let's see what the Hemoglobin has to say. Anything new? A man, a plan, a canal, Globin. Oh, satin DNA ish door I see. Who wouldn't press up on an analog stick for you? For in doing so, that which goes bzzz would find its home. Take, its, t take it to its home, or it weeps, and its tears shall be Globin. Okay. Well, let's try this out. Here it is. Just plop that in there. Perfect. So I guess Bowser just has electricity constantly running through him. This is probably what's gonna activate his fire breath. Ah, interesting. Is that the case? Maybe, or maybe we could just go in. We're going in. So where is that gonna open up to? Whoa, tons of places. Like an absolute ton. So we're at the pump works. We could be going to the flame pipe, or we could be going to the airway, the chest station, the nose deck, or the pipe yard. Let's go to the flame pipe, because the game wants us to go there. Ooh, look at this place. Well, maybe a little too hot. I don't think water really matters around here, so we could probably get Bowser to stop drinking if we wanted to. But you know what? He's gonna keep drinking for now, because I'm too busy. Whoop, perfect. And there we go. Very good. So there's a little thing we can hammer right here. What will this do? Probably open up a door. You bet it will. Okay, so with that done, we're gonna keep moving forward. Hold on. Get up like that. we we'll probably return Mario to normal size again. I don't know if the, yeah, there's a giant pipe underneath us too. That's pretty crazy. Okay, so where are we getting up and around to here? Trying to keep Luigi ca caught up with us. Uh-oh, what's happening? What is that thing? Oh, it's the big bug. Ah, with a big tongue. Oh boy, I've seen these bugs. They lived in Dimblewood. Bowser must have inhaled it with whatever else he ate. 
But to have gotten this big, uh oh, didn't mean to do that. <laughs> I don't know what happened. Of course, the thing is blocking Bowser's flame pipe. No wonder he can't spit fire. Oh. Yep. Oh no, it ate uh, the star sprite. Come on, Luigi, we gotta, we gotta take him out. I know you don't like bugs, but uh, I guess it's just up to Mario, no? Oh no. <laughs> Oh boy, what is this thing? Look at this. So can we just jump on this dude? Would that really even do much? It is the Scutlet, level five. Boing and boing, it does some damage. It was 12 in total. Uh, Whoa, no, Mario, get him out of there. I was not expecting that. I guess I gotta follow his eyes for that one. Let's go ahead and hit him with the hammer. Boom, eight damage that time. So he has some high defense or something. Oh, let's go ahead and use our uh, fire flower. That'll be fun. Okay, ready? This always looks super cool. Okay, he's gonna start with Mario and then switch over to Luigi and then back to Mario. Nice, and then we can just throw them both like crazy. Very nice, 23 damage is insane. They're dancing and everything, I like it. Okay, no, look, there's Wait, are we supposed to hit you? Ow, that hurt. Were we supposed to hit you? Why would I want to hit you? Okay, fine. You know, we're gonna use another bros attack. We're gonna do a fire flower again because it was a lot of fun. And we'll just try this out as well as we can. And just go. Oh, look at how many I can throw. That's very good. Okay. And got it. Oh, it's still 23 damage, even if we. F throw a ton more, so I'm not gonna put in that much effort next time. <laughs> okay, so we could throw in another one. I mean, it seems to be the best damage. I mean, we could also conserve a little bit with this. You know, we could do two green shells instead of one fire flower. That's only if, though, we time it correctly. So let's hope we can do that. That was eight damage. Okay, well then that's not gonna be worth it because eight times, oh no, 21 in total. So that was worth the money, or the BP. Gosh darn it, that is tough to dodge. Okay, so do another bros attack. Oh, we can't afford either of them. Never mind. Guess we'll just go ahead and use your hammer. This guy is tough so far. Definitely Bowser's a whole lot uh, easier to level up than Mario and Luigi. He has fury. See, the green shell, like, because of its cost, you can get a lot more in for the, uh, the cost when you actually do it correctly, not immediately waste it. Gosh darn it, the total two damage. It's just so much easier to mess up, though. Where is he going? What is he doing? He's falling. Whoa! Oh man, he keeps attacking Mario every time. I think we'll just keep with hammering because it seemed to do pretty well. Boom! Seven damage, pretty good. Mario, you can do the same, right? I sure hope so. Ooh. Oh, buddy. What are you doing now? You're gonna fly back up. Okay, so right before he does that, he has a, like a little, like, uh, I don't know, like some kind of little face he puts on there. Dang it. I don't know why I'm suddenly so bad at that. Hammer, I'm getting him this time. Ooh. Perfect, 11 damage there. Okay, trying to get her this time. Dang it. It's sort of weird because there's a gap between the screens and you don't have much time to work with there. Um, he, she, he might just be invincible until we get her out of there or something. I don't know. Well, there's seven more damage. Mario gets healed for two, which is always good. Ooh, and he gets some BP back every time he does some damage as well, so we should be actually able to do the Fire Flower soon. Yeah, he's throwing her again. Yeah, there we go, there's three damage. But no, she's still mad, and she still gets licked up. Oh wait, you're attacking again? You just attacked. Now. Yeah, okay, so yeah, he has a, like a little focus right before he does that. So Luigi still doesn't have enough BP for a move, that's fine. Wind it up and let it rip. Seven damage right there. Okay, Mario, so you have enough BP. Let's go ahead and just do the fire, fire flower. It's just more reliable. Okay, so a bunch of attacks. And then Luigi, a bunch of attacks. Mario, very good, so just throw a bunch more. And 21 damage that time. Not as much, but it's still quite a lot. Pretty good, pretty good. What are you gonna do now? Uh, oh, I'm so bad at that one. Never expected for some reason. Okay, 
Mario got knocked over and my 3DS unplugged. I don't know why that happens so stinking much today. It's driving me nuts. Anyways, uh, dang it. Now I'm like totally thrown off. So Mario is gonna get back up. He's probably gonna attack again then. Oh, not quite. We definitely don't have enough for any of these. So I am just going to go ahead and do a hammer and time this one correctly. Boom, 11 damage there, very good. And that's enough to take him down, nice. Good job, Mario and Luigi, we got rid of the bug, the, the scutter bug or whatever it was. Siphon gloves, pretty good. We get 200 experience each, that is insane. We didn't need nearly that much to get this level up. So level six for Mario, I thought it was gonna be level five. And look at that, we get ourselves a new rank, it's a shell rank, congratulations. Each time your rank goes up, you can select a rank up bonus that will enhance some of your character's attributes. So this is new. Um, we can either get beef, Beefy Bro, which is plus one power and HP for each level up, ooh, or plus one BP and stash for each level up. Mmm. So hard to decide. I want Mario to just keep being the big hitter. Okay, very good. And then when Luigi gets it, maybe we can make him do the other one. So, what do we want to do for his extra stuff? I'm thinking maybe a bit more BP, to be honest with you. I mean, maybe that was a silly idea. Maybe I should just send more power. Okay, here's Luigi, he's level six now. And he's gonna also get the shell rank. Very cool, I love these ranking systems. This wasn't in Superstar Saga, and we'll just have him be the suave bro. All right, very cool. Extra stats for him. And then I definitely want him to have extra BP as well. So 23 BP, very good. Okay, so with that being done, what's going on now? Bowser should be able to breathe fire again, which is real exciting. Who boy, shouldn't have let my guard down. I owe you guys one. And there we go, look at Bowser. Yeah, he's gonna burn, burn down those trees like nobody's business now. Very cool. Whoa, what happened? My flame is back. You had a bug problem. You sucked one up and it plugged your flame pipe. What, really? We already took care of it, calm down, will you? Wahahaha, <laughs> not too shabby. I might have to make you an honorary minion. Uh, no thanks. <laughs> well, forgot I offered. No one needs to know. <laughs> What's your name, anyway? Uh, my name. Yeah, your name, give me it. Um, my name is, uh, Chippy. Chippy, weird name. Yeah, a little weird. Look, it doesn't matter. Wait, hang on, Chippy. Did you just say we? Who else is in there? Huh? Uh, did, did I did I say that? Well, whatever. The only thing that matters is that Captain Flame is back, baby. He's got a fiery temper, but man, is he a fun dude. <laughs> well, look at him go. Well, looks like Princess Peach isn't around here, huh? Nothing we can do. I guess we might as well let Bowser do his thing. Maybe he'll create some more changes in his body environment. All right, well, cool. Look at that. Wah, ha, ha, ha. Just a little touch of why and fa. Any, anybody standing in the way gets done medium rare. Maybe I'd better shake the rust off by burning these trees. All right, so it looks like we'll get started with burning some trees and making some progress with Bowser in the next episode of Mario and Luigi Superstar Saga. No, wrong game. Mario and Luigi Bowser's Inside Story. <laughs> If you want to support the video, make sure you comment Zebra Flames or any bots at the end of the URA Zebra Tastic Viewer. Check out more episodes like this one on your screen right now or by subscribing to join the Zebra Herd. Out the way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye bye.